Now, the annual Strive Conference organized by Smile and Sham Foundation for children between the ages of 10 to 18, Justice Mary Audley and other stakeholders who spoke how the event conversed that child protection should be a responsibility of all and sundry not just selected few. Strive Conference is an annual event for children between the ages of 10 to 18 years aimed at creating awareness on the challenges that surround the Nigerian child, providing solutions and evidence-based personal safety trainings, as well as promoting the protection of children as a shared responsibility by ensuring community, private and public systems engage effectively and respond at all times in the best interest of the child. The one-day event was designed to provide an environment where children will be educated and empowered to become the best versions of themselves amidst the prevalent vices and lingering moral decadence in the society. The event also promotes and celebrates children and your rights, translating into dialogues and deliberations for a better society for the children. Strive Conference is the first and best of its kind in the country and this year had in attendance notable and distinguished speakers such as the former First Lady of River State and retired Justice of the Supreme Court, Honorable Justice Mary Peter Audley retired. Mrs. Titilola Vivo at Deni ably represented Mr. Kevin Donnelly, Barista Temilolu Okeobo, and other distinguished speakers. Smile and Shine Children's Foundation, a non-governmental organization aimed at preventing child sexual abuse and providing emergency care and interventions to victims and those at risk, including members of the family. In partnership with the Lagos State Ministry of Education, the conference had in attendance close to 1,000 students from public and private schools in Lagos State. Retired Honorable Justice Mary Audley, while delivering her remarks, commended the Convener Strife Conference, Dr. Nimi Ekere, for the initiative. According to Justice Mary Audley, speaking on the topic, the Child Rights and the Adolescent Project reiterates the Nigerian Child's Rights Act, stating that necessary protection should be given to any child for its own well-being. She further stated that the Act provides for the rights and responsibilities of the child in Nigeria, such as the right to survival and development, right to a name, to freedom of association and peaceful assembly, to freedom of thought, conscience and religion, to private and family life, to freedom of movement, to freedom from discrimination, to dignity of a child's leisure, recreation and cultural activities, to health and healthcare services, to parental care, protection and maintenance, to free compulsory universal primary education. The convener of Smile and Shan Foundation, Dr. Nimi Ekere, in an interview with journalists at the event, appreciated Lagos State Government for their partnership and direct commitment to ensure every child is protected. She also talked about the foundation plan for the children going forward. There were lots of activities like dance, drama and games. It was really an unforgettable experience as the children were so excited and were all enthusiastic about becoming better versions of themselves. They all had a resolve to strive to work hard and become great men and women in future. The CS conference held at the at the Yemi Bureau Auditorium, Alausa Ikeju, Lagos State, on the 25th of May 2023.